Hello guys, in this video I will show you how to check whether active internet connection is present in your computer with the help of your Java Swing application. So let's get started. What I have done is I have taken a button, J button from my Swing controls and I have added it its text. Just right click and added its text and just I have made this button font size a little bit bigger so just uh, take a button and change its text and then double click this button and then go at the top and write import java.net dot star and then in the button click event here what we are going to write is first of all we will uh, make a try catch block first so just make try and uh, catch the exception and finally try and catch the exception just write this kind of skeleton for try catch block and in here inside this try, try block or above this try block right here socket sock is equal to new socket and in the next line write inet socket address and write addr for example is equal to new inet socket address here and close the bracket and inside these bracket we will pass two argument first will be the some site name so that we can check whether this site is reachable or not and second is the port so I will use port 80 and here I will use www.google.com for example so write this and in here inside this try block we will copy this socket object from here and write dot connect and automatically it will take this inet socket address and second argument just pass here for example 300 this is packet and now you can uh, show this in a uh, J option pane so let's try to show the answer or result in J option pane so right just below your socket dot connect uh, code just make a simple uh, J option pane code so java x dot swing dot J option pane dot show message dialog and first argument would be uh, null for example because I don't want to give any title to it and second option will be the result so result maybe we can uh, show it in the boolean format so if packets are received then we will say string dot value of because we are converting the value from boolean to string so we will write true or else you can just show this message here true ok and in the catch block first catch block here just copy and paste the same j option pane and if the so if the packets are not received then we will write false here and then in here in this 
other try catch block which is covered in this finally write copy the socket and write dot close okay so just write this code if you want you can just pause the video and copy the vid copy the code from here and just right click and run the code and we will check if the code is working or not so right now my internet is connected so it should show true message so just see I click it and it's showing true that means my internet connection is available and for example I disconnect to my internet or I disconnect from my internet so I will write Whoa. disconnect from the internet and now check this internet connection is available or not now it's saying false that means it's not getting the packets and it's saying false once again check so I will connect to the internet once again and internet connection is available yeah connected and I will just press this button is internet connected and it's saying true so in this in this way you can check whether the active internet connection is available on a computer or not so I hope you have enjoyed this video please rate comment and subscribe and bye for now